Hey, welcome back. The Kentucky Nutrition Education Program encompasses two separate USDA programs. Now, the Expanded Food and Nutrition Education Program and the Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program, and the goal of both to educate limited resource families with young children and SNAP eligible individuals so that they can plan nutritious meals on a limited budget, acquire safe food handling practices, improve food prep skills, and change the behavior necessary to have that healthy lifestyle. So joining us now, LaToya Drake. LaToya, good to see you. Good to see you. So this is an important topic. It we, is. We, we were just chatting. I mean, we've talked about farmers markets for years and food to table. And a lot of times uh, that was all great, but just a little bit out of reach to a lot of our folks out it there. It was, definitely. And, and our e farmers markets across the state accept EBT benefits, and that's making um, food and fresh food more, more accessible to all of us, right, and everyone. Right. And many of these farmers market not only accept EBT, they also accept WIC benefits oh. and senior vouchers. Oh, very good. Mm -hmm. Because healthy's for everybody. Healthy's for everybody. And even some of these farmers even double those benefits up to a certain amount with the Kentucky Double Dollars program. Oh, that's fantastic. It, it is fantastic. Very, very Fresh good. for all. Oh, no question. Because it, it did kind of have a lifestyle vibe when, yeah. we, when we were first rolling this out. And, and just, uh, you know, farmer's markets are wonderful, but sometimes it just uh, wasn't quite there for, for families that were trying to make it with a lot of people on the, at the table. Yeah. So you all through UK have, have really found ways forward for, for everyone here, yeah, and, with, and that's tremendous. Yeah, with NEP, and I'm a proud product of, of EBT and SNAP benefits myself, so it's really important mm. for me to get folks eating healthy, with doing the best that they can with what they have. And you can actually buy a variety of foods, the same kind of things that you could buy at the grocery store at your local farmers market or roadside market Tremendous. on the way up here um, I'm from Glasgow Kentucky oh, so wow. South Central Made I a stopped drive, at yeah. Yeah, a Denison's roadside market and okay. they accept EBT too and you can find many of these at your farmers markets like wow. some Kenny cheese oh, from my Kenny home cheese. love it we've got some bacon um, so you can get meat you can get fruits you can get vegetables you can get jams you can get all of these good foods at your farmers market that is tremendous and good to know I imagine the biggest challenge for your organization Mm -hmm. is just helping people understand uh, right. the constellation of services that you offer and how you can kind of navigate people into this healthy right. uh, lifestyle. So uh, what's your best advice for folks that haven't, uh, who want this, obviously, and, and just haven't found that way forward? Well, first and foremost, reach out to your local county extension office. Okay. We're in all 120 counties in Kentucky, right. and they're going to be able to direct you to the farmer's markets and roadside markets in your communities that are going to accept that EBT or senior vouchers, Very and they're going to be able to get you started. And you can also check us out at planeatmove.com. That is our public interfacing website. And that's great. It's We've got a farmer's market and food bank locator. So if you need oh, food nice. resources, we can help get you started if you contact Extension. That's perfect. Mm -hmm. we, we need to co-pilot on this journey. And we that's, all do. that's what the Extension office is so good with. Yeah, In fact, sure. you guys offer so many services, it's kind of hard to keep it all, all yeah. wrapped up. What's, what's the best resource for people to get started on the journey? The here? best resource, if you're in your garden, we've got gardening tools. Okay. Um, basically, check out our website because in yes. that website, you're going to find information to get planning the best diet, to get eating the best food, and to get moving. And okay. you're going to find also growing tips for your garden and just an abundance of free resources. Uh, in addition to that, reach out to your extension office for those plated up Kentucky Proud recipes. Oh, yes. Because when we're getting this local food, we want to make sure that we reduce food waste and yes. we want to make sure that we're using it. So we've got the recipes to inspire you to use that food as Plate well. Plate It Up is a great program, it too. Is. <laughs> well, we appreciate you coming in, Latoya. And thanks for the drive up, too. <laughs> I'm glad to be but here. It sounds like you made the most of yeah. it here, too. You've got a great fun basket. Job. Yeah. So. Come back and see us. This is an important topic, mm -hmm. and we want to keep uh, reminding people that the UK Extension Office, you guys do so much for Thank us. You. Good to see you. Mm -hmm. We're back in just a second, folks. Stick around.